Hey, what's up, everyone? Here's my review for Predators, the new uh, Predator movie. Yay. I've been waiting for this movie for a little while. I was actually pretty excited. I love Predator. So, you know, after hearing they are pretty much making this the sequel to Predator and forgetting everything else that happened with Predator, even though I do like Predator, too, so can't really forget about that movie. But still, this is pretty much the sequel to that movie. Is it any good? Well, that's that's why I'm here, baby. That's why I'm here. And let's go into the story of Predator. Okay, the story of Predators is pretty simple. A whole bunch of mer uh, mercenaries and just elite warriors fall down on this planet. They don't know what planet it is. They don't know if it's their planet, whatever. They just fall onto it. They don't know how they got there. And pretty much the whole plot is them trying to get out of there without getting killed by these mysterious creatures known as Predators, obviously. Uh, but uh, they don't know who they are. They slowly figure out what they actually are, what they actually do. Uh, so I gotta admit, the story ain't bad. The story ain't great, though. Alright? So it's not gonna be like, oh, fantastic. It ain't gonna be like, oh, it's, it's spellbounding. It's not, it's not, uh, mesmerizing, uh, toward the force. It's not like that. But it's, it's good and it gets you through the movie, definitely. So, I think it's okay. So let's go into the acting of Predators. Okay, now the acting in this film overall, I have to admit, was pretty good. The thing that kind of made it a little weak was uh, the act, the, the dialogue. I'm sorry, not the acting. The dialogue. The dialogue was not very good, okay? I mean, it was okay, don't get me wrong. It wasn't like, oh my god, I can't wait until every single one of these motherfuckers die uh, because they're annoying the hell out of me. No, it's more like uh, obvious action movie lines 101, but some of them are a little clever, I have to admit. Um... The acting just overall was pretty good. Uh, I'm not going to talk much about the acting. I'll, I'll say Adrian Brody, he definitely did great. Uh, he played the action hero, and he did it very well, I have to admit. Uh, Alice Braga, who plays the kind of, I don't know, the girl. The girl in the movie, the only girl. You'll see her. Uh, she, okay, she was in other movies like Repo Men and I Am Legend. And she's, well, whatever, another, I guess, heroish kind of character. And uh, she's okay. She is okay. Uh, not fantastic. Uh, she has that accent that I'm like, eh, you could get rid of that. Uh, come on. Come on, get rid of it. It's kind of annoying. But, uh, yeah, she was okay. Uh, Lawrence Fishburne's in it for like 10 minutes, and, you know, he's okay. Really, he's literally in this for 10 minutes. I'm not going to tell you what happens to him, but obviously not something nice. Uh, Oh, what's his name? Uh, Topher Grace, he does okay. Topher Grace, after Spider-Man 3, I kind of wanted him to die and burn in hell, but in this, he's okay. Everybody else was pretty good overall. A lot of other no-name actors, pretty much. I mean, they have a name, obviously, but they're not really big actors. I mean, there is a couple other ones out there, like uh, Walton, Walton Goggins, who plays like the kind of like the comedy comedy character, you know, the comedic character, I'm trying to say. And, you know, he's pretty funny. He's a little crazy in the head a little bit, and uh, yeah, he was an okay character, so overall, acting's pretty good, overall, so I keep saying overall, <laughs> overall, overall, it's going, <laughs> which is funny, because the next section is the overall of the film, what do I think of this film, let's go to the overall of the film, <laughs> okay, now overall, Predators was actually a pretty good and fun movie, it definitely paid homage to the first one, with little winces at it, and whatever, it didn't really pay attention to anything that the other Predator movies uh, did, like Predators 2, where, I mean, Predator 2, where they, they, the freaking Predators in whatever city it's in, they never freaking say, oh, the Predator was once uh, in the city, uh, whatever city that was, I forgot. Um, and I, I like that, because, I mean, Predator 2 isn't bad, but it definitely does not, even, it's not even close as good as the second one, I mean, first one is. So, Overall, I really like this film. It's very fun, very gory, uh, pretty good, well acted, okay story, good action, pretty good CG. Uh, and overall, it's a fun movie. I like the new design of some of these Predators also. Uh, new gadgets, well, not really new gadgets. They don't really use their laser beams that much, whatever the hell they're called, the, the laser cannon. And I wish I saw more head blasting with the laser cannon, to be honest, because that's one of my favorite kills that the Predator could do. Uh, you know, pew, the friggin' head explodes like a watermelon, you know. So overall, I give this movie an 8.4 out of 10. Very fun, very good. I have to admit, I really, really like this. So overall, that's it. I know this review wasn't that good, 
but I'm really, 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 really stressed at the moment. So, sorry. I have to go do something right now. And yeah, I'm stressed about this moving thing that's going on in my house. Uh, I have to go do something right now. I uh, hope you enjoyed the review, and bye.